2020 we are traveling guys we are going out of the country i won't only do um hidden gems i will also try go out there show you how it is to be a kenyan traveling <laughs> uh, hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi my name is kit welcome to the egyptian series and on the first episode it's all about cairo i'll be showing you guys where to eat where to sleep and things you can do so i'm super excited for that stick around i know the video is going to be long but it's going to be amazing now first things first how do you even get to cairo i'm going to speak from a kenyan perspective for me i needed to get my visa i needed to do my covid test that was valid within 72 hours and the 72 hours is actually really important like you have to make sure it's within 72 hours another thing is that my covid test cost six thousand shillings that is sixty dollars right yeah so i did all that and now we are here so let's begin let's begin Guys, there's a lot of hooting. A lot of hooting. There's a lot of hooting. <laughs> so guys, people drive crazily here. Like I'm a Kenyan and you're known for bad traffic and bad driving. And I'm telling you, Egypt takes the cake, okay? The way they drive here it's madness. And they hoot a lot. There's a lot, a lot of hooting. But we've reached safely to where we are. So this is the beginning of where to eat. There are so many places you can eat around Egypt and it depends whether you want uh, something that's oriental, that's very really Egyptian or you just want like fast food. I will show you all these options. So one of the first places you should definitely try is called Palak Bookstore. We were brought here by actually somebody we met on the internet, a stranger on the internet brought us here. And we had their oriental breakfast. We'll show you guys what it has. It's actually very filling and it's very, very cheap. So let's have that first. So guys the food is here and i'm so excited it's actually quite a lot and i'm happy about that so there's falafel there's full there's bread there's cheese and some veggies on the side so i'm excited to eat So guys, we're just done with our breakfast. We are going to the Hindu palace or how is it? The other name, I can't tell what to place it here. It's one of the most um, requested places to visit. So that's where we are going to go. So guys, we are here at the Baron Palace, aka the Hindu Palace. I'm so excited to show you guys how beautiful it looks from outside. It's really so pretty. So let's head in and see how beautiful it is. She's right there, I can't deny the beauty before my eyes. I can't help but fall in line Cause there's truth in her lies Once again, I've lost my way Chasing cars and wasting days Am I here to pass your time? Cause all I see are blurred lines Am I just chasing dreams? Is this not what it seems? Have I read between the lines, those blurred lines, those blurred lines? Is this 
so guys we're done with the hindu palace and now we're headed to a famous market called kanel kalili i hope i've not butchered that name i'm hoping to get a scarf and a dress because we are also going to go to a mosque and i really want to respect the islamic culture and be modest so uh, let's go Guys, I hope you can hear me. We are still in the market. We are about to have pancakes and pizza. Egyptian pancake and Egyptian pizza. I'm so excited to see how it looks like. But we already have our drinks. Let me show you. I must be blind to think that I could steal her heart and change her mind. Fantasy, I realize that there's truth in her lies. Once again, I've lost my way, chasing cars and wasting days. Hey guys, so yesterday. <laughs> We were so tired they didn't even close off the vlog but we went back home i am lucky enough to have somebody who is living here who's accommodating us but i wanted to show you guys like a few options of where you can stay while you are here in cairo now we have just checked in into our room today morning and i just want to show you guys the room tour before we start a day full of activities am i here to pass your time because Blurred lines in my chest, chasing dreams. Is this now what it seems? Have I read between the lines? Those blurred lines, those blurred lines. Is this real or am I chasing dreams? Is this real? So we'll definitely uh, give you guys more options. I might not show them, but they will be down in the description or you can even fill them here. Right, Hilary? No? Okay, they'll be down in the description. Hotels here are actually very affordable because Kenyan hotels can be pretty expensive. I'm really surprised because right now we're in Ramses Hilton and it cost us $91 for bed and breakfast and we have the Nile view. Like how amazing is that? So today, first thing, we are going to Abdin, Abdin Museum Palace. I'm so excited. It is in the top of our list. So let's head there and see how amazing it is. You don't know what goes on behind these eyes. You don't know the loneliness hidden inside. You don't know I want to eat you up alive. Come and get to know me, my type of wild. I'm the kind that spins you and hangs you dry. Well, I'm already on to another side. If you gave me your whole life, I would still have a room for more. Cause I've got that appetite. Baby, I never feel old. You might get me through the night, but it won't ever be enough. It will never be enough. Cause I'm a black, I'm a black, I'm a black girl for your life. Guys, we're just done with Abdin Museum Palace. That place is so, so big. I don't even know if we went through everything. But it's so big, so beautiful, and it's very guarded. But I think it's because of all the precious things that are inside there. So it's definitely a must visit when you come to Cairo. Right now, we are at Zuwela Gate. Let me just show you how beautiful it looks. So 
like you na 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 my center of gravity cause it's true na 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 everything they say about me it's so pretty guys it's time for me to go up and look at the view myself it's so scary i'm not afraid of heights but i feel like it's so so high hillary is afraid of heights actually but he's managed to go up so hillary a clap for hillary guys but from here you can actually see how cairo looks like it's not all glitz and glamour like any other african country there's always <laughs> there's always a place so guys we're done with the veil again and now it's time to go to the mosque finally i can use my dress so let's go and look at mosque of ibn i will not even try mosque of <laughs> let's go guys we're finally here at the mosque of ibn Tuk. We said we are not going to butcher words, so we are here and it's absolutely beautiful, it's so majestic and I feel calm. When I entered I just felt calm, I don't know why and I felt relaxed but it's so beautiful and massive. <sighs> I can't believe it, it's so breathtaking, like it's that good. So uh, let me show you guys around and you'll enjoy, you'll like this. <laughs> As you've seen, it's so breathtaking. It's so big. I love it. I just love it here. But we're finally done. And now it's time to go back to the hotel and eat some good food because I'm so tired and I'm so hungry. So this is a definitely must visit place when you're in Cairo. And I just want to appreciate the Uber guys here. No one has said, oh, it's too far or they don't pick. Like all our Ubers have been picked in Kenya. If you're going far, no one will take you they'll let you accept and then they won't take you they'll just cancel so i really appreciate that here <laughs> So guys, we just had McDonald's. I'm also waiting again for KFC. I just wanted to try the KFC to see if it's different from home. Imagine we do not have a McDonald's in Kenya. I don't understand why we don't have it. But we don't have it. So we just had a Big Mac, a Chicken Mac, cheeseburger, and their fries. Their fries are... I love them. So I'll review for you guys the KFC. Also, Nimeka took... Okay, I need to speak English just for the international audience. But we've just been in the hotel. We've seen such an amazing sunset. I'm listening to the pink print because of a verb. And it's been six years. We're celebrating six years of the pink print. Like it's been six years. Wow. So, yeah, I think after eating the, um, the KFC, we will head to sleep and we'll... Tom Kakesho, am I the only one who's excited about hotel breakfast? I can't be the only one. I love hotel breakfast. This breakfast, breakfast. <laughs> and tomorrow we're also going to the pyramids. We're going to the pyramids. Finally, we are going to do what many people come to do in Egypt. So, bye guys. Good morning, girl. Hi. Good morning. So, 
yeah trying to the kfc just to see if it's going to be different from home and there's actually not much difference the only difference was that it wasn't as spicy as the way it's spicy at home and also in their menu they have things like rice and shrimp we don't have that so right now it's a bit foggy this is why you should not go to the the bit eh? can't speak this i should not uh, go to the pyramid in the morning because you may not see them because of the fog so waiting for the fog to clear but i'm not sure if it's only during winter or it also happens uh during summer when it's hot but right now it's very very foggy we'll go to the pyramids later in the afternoon i'm also pleased that um, our checkout is around 2 p.m so we have time to rest and sleep in because we've been having very long tiring days so let's go have breakfast. Everything is about me, I'll suck you. Na 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 na, my center of gravity, cause it's true. Hey guys, so we're just done at the hotel and now we're headed to the pyramids. It was actually a very nice stay. I love the view and they're also welcoming. When we're having breakfast, breakfast, like after every three minutes, they'd come and ask us if we were okay. They were all very kind. So let's go to the pyramids. <laughs> I would still have room for more Cause I've got that appetite Baby, I never feel whole You might get me through the night But it will never be enough It will never be enough Cause I'm a black, I'm a black I'm a black girl for your life Guys, we're back home from the pyramids. They are absolutely beautiful and majestic. I totally understand why they are a wonder of the world. Unfortunately, you can't even climb the pyramids. You're not allowed to do that. We should have done that. We also did not enter inside the pyramids because you need to pay extra to enter. And we are on a budget here. We're trying to travel to different places in Egypt. That's why we did not go inside. But they're absolutely beautiful. It's a must see. <laughs> it has to be in your bucket list. So egypt is more than the pyramids and all these museums there are also different places you can go especially now that it's during the festive season the malls are absolutely decked out it's amazing it's so beautiful so let me show you guys how the malls look like and different places you can go if you're in egypt already or if you can plan to visit here during the festive season
before we came back home i had a very very amazing cup of hot chocolate uh from one of the malls that we went to actually it was the mall of egypt or arabia mall of egypt yeah <laughs> mall of egypt it's called house of coco and it was just absolutely amazing we also ate at a place called ovio ah i had the most amazing pasta there we've also eaten at starbucks i had their cheesecake from there and oh my god it was absolutely amazing it's actually my first time having starbucks and i was so happy to have that so there are so many other places that you can eat around egypt we'll definitely put them in the description because i reached out to different food creators and they were able to tell me places that i must visit some places I also add in the other series because this is just the first episode there's going to be episode two and three inshallah and i will show you guys all these beautiful places so that's it from me i hope you enjoyed this video make sure to like share and subscribe comment down below on other places that people must, must visit in egypt so that you can you know spread the word about this beautiful city i'll see you guys on the next video